Hey, we're Brian Company here. Welcome to my beer library where I do beer reviews and a beer vlog. Today we're going to be trying the Holly Jolly Christmas Ale by Fatheads Brewery. Uh, this is in Athens, I believe, Middlesburg Heights near Athens, um, Ohio. So Fatheads Brewery, chill out man, have a beer. Matt Chris Glenn, that's the uh, owners of that and the top says spice up your holidays over and over again but you uh you got the typical fat heads guy and he's in a different attire he's in a santa claus outfit with the lights um 7.5 percent aqua volume 28 ibus and this is a christmas ale so i'm just expecting it to be kind of like a have spices in it um have a little bit of a dark tinge to it but we will see, huh? So it has about the coloration, as I was expecting, for a Christmas sale. There's a lot of Christmas sales. They have popped up over the years, um, have become quite popular, actually. Another way to uh, just sell something else that is relevant for that season, and it catches on, kind of like an Oktoberfest. So, there you go. That's good. It does have spices in it. Uh, tastes uh, kind of like cinnamon and other spices in there. Um, kind of like a molasses taste to it. Um, towards the back end, you get a little bit of an alcohol taste in there, a little beer taste. So, all in all, really good though, actually. Um, so, we will go ahead and give this a score. Uh, let's see what it smells like here. Has that same molasses slash straw uh, odor to it. Kind of like an Oktoberfest, if you will. Um, but, uh, not, not. Not so much straw, kind of more of a spiced, like, I don't know what, how to describe that, like a spiced molasses odor. Um, so let's give this a score. Um, zero being the worst, 100 being the best, I would give this a score of... I'd say a score uh, for the Christmas ale category, 89. So almost in the 90s. Um, I do think it's good. Sometimes I like it when I put the stories on the can. Um, but uh, like the, it's kind of like one dimensional flavoring going through it. I mean, you taste the spices, but it doesn't, that's the flavoring through the whole thing, so. Um, yep, that's what I got. And, uh, you know, there you go. That's what you got. So, uh, what do you think? Leave that in the comments. What's your favorite Christmas ale? Leave in the comments. My pro my probably my favorite would be, uh, Great Lakes Christmas Ale. The, they have had a Christmas sale that have gotten every single year. And once I find a Christmas sale that I kind of like, then I usually will like keep going back and trying to find a six pack of that and having it during the Christmas time. So it is a Christmas tradition, just like Oktoberfests are for October. So I do see the marketing behind it. Yeah, but uh, it is good when you f can find these these companies that do it every year and, and then you try to find it every year. Um, some companies will switch up the flavorings every year. Some will do the same flavorings every single year. So, um, but there you go. So what's your favorite? Put that in comments. Um, Great Lakes is mine, like I've said, um, and I've done v videos on that before, but uh, uh, also like, subscribe, share this video, watch my other videos. I have a ton of review videos. I'm sure you'll find something that you've tried in the past and, uh, and you're gonna like it. So there you go.
and uh, share the video, share the channel. That's how the channel grows. Thanks you. And try something you never had before, like I just did. Cheers.